Pambabayan ang Pambansang Awit ng Pilipinas. Play a song. Let's sing it joyfully. That's right, because it's Christmas time. No, during Christmas, these trees have special meaning. Do you know what a deciduous tree is? Deciduous? Deciduous trees lose leaves during winter, but the Christmas tree is different. There are very few trees that remain green when there is snow. They are called evergreen. That sounds right. Evergreen for evergreen. That's right. And because Christmas is such a special occasion, a decorated Christmas tree makes for the perfect decoration. But why do you always put an angel on the tree? Come here, and I'll tell you why. You see, angels played an important role in the first Christmas. 
Gabriel, the revelation angel, told Mary that she would be the mother of Jesus Christ on earth. There was also once an angel who visited Joseph in a dream. He was told he would be Jesus' father on earth. Many angels appeared in the sky over Bethlehem to announce and celebrate Jesus' birth as the world savior. My name is Gabriel. Come with me to a place where there's no time as you mortals know it. Let me take you to a place called heaven, where everything is perfection, where angels fill the cars of God with song, where music is the expression of praise. But there's no ordinary day in heaven. This is the day when God plans to tell his angels about the coming birth of his son. Excitement is everywhere. The angel choir has been called together for a grand rehearsal. But they don't know the reason. The harps are tuned up, the director said selected the music, and the musicians are... Oh, wait. Oh, here they come. Harold Angels! Yes, sir? Where have you all been? Do you realize that you are late for a very important choir result? Sorry, ma'am, but we keep forgetting to check on the heavenly sundial. What have you been doing that was so very important? Who? Me? Yes, you two. All of you. What in heaven were you doing to make you forget to come to choir practice? Why? You were talking to the Son of God. I like to talk to God's Son too. Because he's never reading the paper and he always has time to listen to me. I'll tell him when my puppy gets hurt because he made all the animals and he cares about them. You know, you can tell him anything because he really cares and he understands too. Even though he's the King of Kings and the Lord of everything, he loves to listen to us. What's going on? 
I don't have the slightest idea. Well, I wish I knew. Quiet. I know you are as curious about what is going on. To tell you the truth, I don't know all the details, but I do know that something mighty wonderful is about to take place down on Earth. Well, what on Earth is it? Shh! Listen! God is about to... To do what? Well, God wants members of this choir to sing the greatest announcement that has ever been made. Do I have any volunteers? Very good, angels! Gabriel, sir, may we ask you a question? Oh, uh, what did you say, young man? <clears throat> sir Gabriel, can you tell us what's going to happen down on Earth? Who are you, sons? We, we are the Herald Angels. Angels. We are also Herald Angels. Oh, yes, I know you. You're the angels who like to talk and ask questions. But, sir, we are Herald Angels, and Herald Angels have to make announcements, and those who make announcements have to know what's going on. Oh, my. We know you make all the important announcements around here, so you really must know what's happening. Well, sons, I only know what God tells me. Then as God told you what's going to happen down on earth, do you know why we're singing? What the Whoa, boy, hold it. Let me ask you a question. What do you know about the people who live down on earth? Oh, I know the people down there are called human beings. I've heard that humans fight and cheat and hate and lie and kill and... God knows that. And Sam is hard to realize that the people he created uh, turned out so badly. He realizes that man is by nature a sinner. But Sir Gabriel, why doesn't God do something to make human beings better? That's exactly what God is going to do. And that's the answer to your question about what's going to happen down on Earth. Huh? 
That's something I can't understand. Then listen carefully to me. The time has come for God to go back into Earth to show human beings what He really is like. He's going to show them love by becoming a human baby. A and baby? baby? The baby's name will be Jesus. Jesus? But how will our big God fit into a tiny baby? I wonder if this water will have to teach him that the fire is not the man for and they will cut. Would he have to tell him to wash his hands and face? Do you think he'll never lose a race? Oh, I get it. When the baby Jesus grows up, he'll fight all the wicked humans. He'll start the giant war on earth and all the evil people will be killed. Then, the world will be the way God wanted it to be, and He'll be a king! No, my little angels, that's not what God will do. He'll be a man and at the same time God. He will be the Son, but still God. He will love humankind, but He will hate their sinful ways. Oh, Gabriel, it's all so confusing. I have another question. Why would God want to leave this beautiful place to go down there on Earth? He'll do it hard, because he loves those people so very much. But how will loving people make them better? I'm glad you asked that question, Hark. He'll love them so much that he'll pay the price for their sinning by dying for them. Dying? dying? Yes, by dying so that man will never have to die for the accept his love. Boy, he really must love them very much. Tell us please, Gabriel, when the baby's going to be born. It's going to happen. Now. It's time to go. Come along, my angels. Where? Where are we going? You'll see, my angels. You'll see. Come along. Better. It's like your birthday too, right? Well, 
if they give you what you want. I love presents, Mom, especially those in big boxes. In fact, the bigger they are, the better. That's the best Christmas present. No, son, that's not the best Christmas present. It's not? Then what is it? That's lots of dolls. That's not it either, honey. Son, why don't you try this? To find out what the best Christmas present is, start to play an 8 scale. Go ahead, try it. I don't see how an 8 scale could be the best present this Christmas. That doesn't sound like the gift. Honey, you're doing it all wrong. You have to play it backwards. Huh? That still doesn't sound like the best gift, Mom. Is this supposed to be a joke? It's not funny, Mom. Hmm. <laughs> Be patient, honey. You'll have to play the scale again, but this time, you've got to pose in the 1st, 2nd, 4th, 6th, 7th, and 8th notes. Huh? Mom? Why do you have to make it so hard? Why can't you just tell me? You have to try, honey. Then you will understand better. I don't know about you, but for Christmas, the best presents are always toys. That's what Christmas is all about. Not some scales or notes, toys! Toys? Did someone say toys? They bring joy indeed. They make for the best Christmas presents. But while children fight to each get their toys, did you know that toys also fight to be given as gifts? They each claim to be the best gift. Right now, the presents are waiting under the tree. I'm so bored! Me too! How much longer before we are open? I'm getting a numb bottom from all this sitting around. You were lucky you could sit. Every time you sit down, I run the way on the floor. Last time I ran the way, the dog almost got me. Someone had left the door open. Well, I have to be very careful how I sit. Fragile I am can be bumped. And I'm so smart. You sat on me. I must squash me. Sorry, couldn't see behind me. Been so big and all that. Anyway, someone small like you should know to keep us away way of someone large and important like me. Who says you're important? Big is best. Everyone knows that. The best thing comes from small packages. I've got a pretty slow. I think that makes me most important. No, you're all wrong. I'm the most important. It's what's inside that counts. Everyone's heard that before. So what's inside you then? The latest transforming supercharged dynamite laser, that's what. Oh! Who cares what you are? I'm a gift for a very special person. That's more important. It's the people that count, not things. Foil! What? Foil! Foil is a superior graphic. It's all about looks. My bow is nicer than your foil. It curls in the end. See? Well, I've got stickers. I'm the best rap. And look at all my glitter. Well, I'm handmade with love and care. Oh! Guess you can't be that. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Isn't the biggest best? Small. The best thing comes from small packages. Foil, it's all about foil. My bow! Handmade! It's what inside that counts. Stop! Stop! With all the noise, you're shaking the tree. I am trying to look peaceful and serene on the highest point of the tree, but all I can hear is you and lots of arguing, and then the tree starts rocking. It's our damn fault. They don't know that big is best. Hard me. Prettiest is best. Yeah, and that's me. Quiet! Quiet! That's what you're arguing about? Who's the best present? Oh dear me, it's time you all met Mary, Joseph, and baby Jesus. Now he 
Look sharp, everyone. Audience approaching. Greetings. Oh, it's you, Angel. Hello again. Now, Joseph, can you point to the most important present here? Here he is. Oh, that's just a doll and a boy one. I've got much nicer girl doll inside me. Let me explain. These friends of ours are here to remind us of some people that really lived 2,000 years ago. Oh! Wow! That was before I was made in China. I know this is just a doll, but this doll represents someone real. Someone who was the greatest gift of all time. Oh! Oh, you would say that? You're his father? No, he's not. This baby was born the son of the king of kings. Well, he must be one of yours then. No, no. The king of kings is the god of the heavens and the earth. He who made everything. Oh! I wish you'd stop doing that ooh thing. It's starting to get on my nerves. What's the son of God doing in a dirty stable? It's not dirty. I swept it this morning. There's all those melee animals. Jesus was born a baby just like you and me. He didn't get special treatment even though he was the son of God. But he was God's perfect gift. Jesus gave up his royal kingdom with God his father and was born down here to do special work of God so that one day we can live in God's kingdom as God's own son and daughters. Oh, us royalty? Don't think I want to give up a royal palace for a dirty stable! It's not dirty! I'm not sure that he would give his royal kingdom with us Especially, selfish way you have been behaving. Jesus is God's present to us. That's why we celebrate Christmas. We celebrate His birth and all He was about to do for us. The star! The star is there! I don't see anything. It's there! No, no, it's on the east! There it is! Yes! The, the star! star. We three kings of Orient are Bearing gifts we cherish afar Field and fountain more and out And following yonder star Oh, star of wonder, star of night Star with
the star that led us to the manger where Jesus was born. We gave Jesus gifts. You presents remind people of our giving too. We gave special gifts to the baby Jesus. But, but the, the greatest, greatest giving of all was a gift God, God gave us, us his mm. son. Fear not and behold, I bring you good tidings and great joy which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord.
rock it anymore. And keep the noise down. Guess we're not the most important gifts after all. I'm still good looking though. Do you think the children will remember, as they open us, that we represent the greatest gift of all time? The gift God gave us? Will the others remember? Best day in our places, it will be a chaos here soon. Wrapping paper everywhere. Smiles all around. Oh, a jewel of Christmas? Ah. Okay, magandang araw, mga mag-aaral. Malapit na ang Pasko. Sa kabila na lahat ng mga nangyayari sa ating, sa ating bansa ngayon, Ano sa palagay ninyo yung pinaka magandang regalo na maaari nung ibigay niya at ang lagi? Okay, Jasmine. Uh, instead of the smart and the power, mas gusto ko sa iyo kung kakain ng mga nangyayari. Galing. Ngayong araw, nais ko kayo ay gumawa ng listahan ng mga regalo na nais ninyo yung tanggapin para sa araw ng pasok.
You were early for Christmas celebrations! I thought we will help you decorate for Christmas this year. What are you doing, Lola? I'm fixing the nativity scene. Would you like to help me? Yes, Lola. Hey, look. What do you think sits inside it? We all receive a special gift, but none more special than the Christmas gift that God's gift to us. What Christmas gift is more special than toys for the baby? Honey, look. Dad is playing the piano. Yay! Joy to the world! Heart, that is the good news. Just wait and see how it will wake up the world. The good news will not stop with them, but they will share the message with everyone they meet. They will share the good news that God has come to their world through their son Jesus. Someday, there will be peace.